statue of my brother. How quaint. That's odd. The runes are dark. What purpose does all this serve, other than a testament to my brother's vanity? Difficult to say without an inscription. <laughs> it looks like the elves built this place together, light and dark. Which means this would have been their first act of cooperation in generations. A far cry from lasting peace, but perhaps it served as a monument. One that symbolizes the potential for peace. survived Freya's absence, but a truce clearly did not. Monuments are useless to those who ignore their message. He didn't create a truce through diplomacy alone. His godhood, his very presence is what healed this land and allowed peace to take root. But once he left, he had to have known what would happen. Well, he had good reason to leave. Some jackass convinced his sister to marry a madman. Nothing reminds people of their history like chiseled, well-lit marble. You're right. Normally we'd have to provide our own. Perhaps slotting a crystal on the opposite side could shed some light on this mystery. <laughs>
like we can read the inscription now as well. In honor of the Enlightened One, may his gift of light shine eternal. Ah, gift of light. The light from the crystals. It is in the sand now. Would you look at that? Freya's gift endures after all. Or should I say, his... Presents. You are not funny. <laughs> Even when Freya was actually here, the peace was fragile. Surely a bit of extra light in the desert isn't enough to make it last. Before I met Faye, I could not imagine a life of peace. After her death, in our travels to Jotunheim, I found peace on my own. It remains my responsibility to make it last. Perhaps the elves will find peace again one day, even without Freya's guidance. His presence continues to guide them, whether they realize it or not. We can bring these two animals back to Vanaheim, or Midgard even. Specky and Svana could use the company. We have kennels. It would not go well for them. Once a predator becomes accustomed to a land, it is cruel to move them. I suppose you're right. It just seems lonely out here. It is peaceful. They have each other. It is enough. <laughs> a key? A key. Must open something around here. You know, Freyr loved to breed Gulan pups in Vanaheim. I wonder if these two are the descendants of the Gulan he brought here long ago. That explains how they got to the desert. Another gift for the Dark Elves. wonder, how'd these two pups end up yoked to the sleigh? Ever try flying in a sandstorm? I imagine Freyr showed the Dark Elves that Gulon could be trained to pull a plow. They must have found new uses for them once the sandstorm arrived. I imagine they're now bred to aid in traveling the surface. Another key, ah! eh? Sooner or later, we're gonna have to find a lock to put them in.
Light Elf architecture. It's massive. not happen. Mine, imprisoning a drake. Can't decide whether to be impressed or horrified. Either way, it is over now.
a token. A badge of honor. The elves made a few of these. They'd hang them up up. Their dwellings show their support for my brother. That's all my brother's tributes. Would you prefer we hang on to them? Do what you will. If Freyr didn't bother taking them when he left Alfheim, he wouldn't mind us selling them to the dwarves.
we found the Consul's journal. Thank you, Kratos. It is exactly what we were hoping for. The Consul risked everything to understand the mistakes of our past. And now those lessons can live on. Thank you, Kratos. The Elves and we won't forget this. They aren't liable to forget all the bloodshed between them, either. There's a path towards peace for all of us. Nobody said this would be easy. Face some old things. There's a day I hate thinking about. Well, your position was quite clear. No, I mean... Because it was a day I chased you away. All I wanted was for you to not go. But I was just so... Angry. That day I said the dumbest stuff I've ever said. And you know how much I have to choose from. Ingvi, listen. I'm only trying to say... I closed a chapter today I thought I never could. Maybe every bit of anger and pain we can find a way to let go of is a gift we can give ourselves, you know? I'll drink to that. If I may ask, do you miss Alfheim? You mean, do I miss the light? Do you? The truth? I still feel its pull. You want nothing else when you're near it. And away from it, you're only biding time until you can drink again from the light. But then again, the light does not make good food. It doesn't play music or tell jokes or open your eyes to new things. Excuse me. Looks like we're heading out. brother. Before you see the lad again, might we discuss an approach? He will tell me where he has been. That is my approach. Ah, classic Spartan diplomacy. Wait. Did you say Odin invited him to Asgard, and then he disappeared for two days? Aye. But surely the lad's got more sense than to... Don't underestimate Odin's powers of persuasion. He filled my son's head with lies. Why wouldn't he do the same with yours? Sucker, he owes me one. Fight me now and eternally. Well, looky there. Glad you could make the trip, your goddessness. I put your sigil magic on the young turd's bow. But then he and Sindri got into it over something. Mm, I don't rightly know who's yelling at who in there, but I figure they both got it coming. Hello! 
Good to see the chimes working as intended. So, who else are we likely to encounter amongst your detachable emotional apparitions? Well, there's certainly no avoiding anxiety. Oh no. Why are you talking about me? What did I do? Oh, you should have heard the shit they were talking. Sadly. What? Oh dear, oh dear. There was no such talk. Shame on you, Bitter. Are you sure? Yes, Anxious. No opprobrium to be found in this discourse. I was merely making your acquaintance with our adventuring friends here. Ah! People! Well, there it is. Please come back any time. Talk to squirrels now, huh? Well, come on, man. Hey, Tear! Wake up! You got company. Now, why don't you just make yourself at home in Sindri's so-called study over yonder? You're sure he won't mind? Mind? He'll be thrilled. Joint's getting classier by the day. Can it be? I never thought I'd have the pleasure of seeing you again, Frigg. Uh, don't call me that. I haven't been that person in a long time. But I'm happy to see you, too. I'd feared the worst for so long, what you must have been through. Nothing so bad as what you've suffered. Freya, I am so, so sorry to hear what happened to Baldur. He was only a boy when I saw him last, but I know he meant more to you than anything. Yes. And to forbear your vengeance in this way, it's, it's truly an inspiration for those of us who believe in peace. The only peace these realms will ever know is once Odin is gone. Believe in that. So you're not here to prevent Ragnarok. You're here to bring it about. I'm here to make sure Odin doesn't hurt anyone. The way he hurt us. I can see I've upset you. <sighs> Forgive me. I am far removed from my days of diplomacy. Not too shabby having a proper goddess around the house. Try to stay on her good side this time, why don't you? She's no less majestic than the last day I saw her. What a thing I must be to look at. I truly thought we'd seen the last of Tyr. Perhaps there really is cause for hope. Screw his head back on, and I mean tightly. So you're back. Are you ready to answer me? About what? Where did you go? Who did you see? Was it Odin? What? Is that what you think? Do you deny it? <laughs> answer me! Did you go to Asgard? No! Of course not! But so what if I did? 
It's my future. It's my life. You are my son. Then why don't you trust me? If you want me to trust you, then tell me the truth. The truth is you're being a complete asshole. Laddie, you know that's no way to change a man's mind. He doesn't have any faith in me. It's fine if he keeps secrets. It's fine if Mom did. That is not fine. Her secrets haunt every step of this path. Oh, okay. So you don't believe in her anymore either? This is not about your mother. What you have done is lie. Wonder where I learned that. That's quite enough. Since when do you always take his side? Since he became the one making sense. Look, I was only thinking about going to Odin. But I swear it's for a good reason. There is no good reason to go to Odin. He'll only cloud your mind. But I'd be going for us. I, I gotta stop something bad from happening. Something bad did happen. Look at me. At Freya, at Tia. Odin did this to us. What's got everyone caterwauling all of a sudden? Atreus wants to go to Asgard. Asgard? Get kicked in the head or something? Great. I guess everybody's against me now. You must choose who you're going to be. Are you going to continue to lie and keep things from me? Or are you my son? Choose? I never get to choose. Just leave me alone. Listen. Let go of me. Listen. Let go. What the fuck? Atreus! It's Sindri. Just, just try to keep control. some shelter. Something out here doesn't want to kill me. Just need someplace warm. Then I can figure out where to go next. Doesn't look good. What is this thing? Some kind of white? Oh! 
You trying to tell me something? First, he thinks I've been to Asgard. Then, blind. Ah! Uh. I'm trying to save your life, you big jerk! shelter and then what? Where could I go? If I go to Asgard, following the prophecy where father ends up dead, if I stay locked up at home, there's nothing I can do to stop it. I guess in Asgard, I could at least keep an eye on Odin. Be a spy. Find out his plan. Get control of this. Oh, who am I kidding? I can't go to Asgard. Wait, are those red leaves? Freya's house. Oh, no. Charlie? No. Charlie! Please. Please! Charlie! Mm. <laughs> hey, big 
guy. I'm here now. Don't you worry. I need to get you warm. You're gonna have to stand to let me into that house. Think you can do that? Come on, Charlie. You have to do this. I... I can't help if you don't... Emily! Emily! Buddy, I know it's cold in here. <sighs> I should close that window before snooping around. Freya hasn't been checking on you, right? Too busy hunting us down. Come on, let's get you warmed up. Should be able to make a fire from all this mess. Wow, it's beautiful. Never seen anything like this around here before. From around in Vanaheim? She must have really missed it. Valkyrie armor? Does this go with the wings on the wall? From her friend? I wonder what happened to her. Is this... Baldur's? I wonder how Father was able to earn her forgiveness. Okay, buddy, okay. I'll get you warmed up. I can't believe she never came back to check on her house. To check on you. That's not an excuse. here for me. I'll be okay. I think. Okay. I'm ready. Take me to him.
Should have learned to swim before Midgard froze over. <laughs>